Alright everybody, welcome back to more Pikmin 2, no deaths, and uh, I'm scared guys, I'm, I'm really scared, cause we, we've had, we've had some difficult moments up till now, but we've crossed the threshold now, this is the part of the game where it's not pulling any punches anymore, we've just seen a taste of the difficulty that awaits us now, we are, we've finished the submerged castle, which was a great dif difficulty, but we have five caves left, and they're all going to be significantly harder than pretty much anything that we've seen. Or I guess a couple of them might be comparable to Submerged Castle, but oh. This is where we see how sadistic the game can get. And I know I've been hyping it up for a while, but yeah. I, I, I think I said at the beginning of this that I was going to do this game no deaths. I think I misspoke. I'm going to try to do the game no deaths. But I honestly don't know if I'll be physically able to beat this challenge. I'm going to try my best, but... We'll just have to wait and see. Hey, Simpsons R Us, <laughs> welcome. I'm prepared for a lot of raging, too. I'm going into this with the expectation that I'm going to have to reset a ton. I'm, if I don't have to reset a bunch, I consider that a bonus. But I'm just going into this expecting the worst. Because I know what it's, what's awaiting me, and it's not going to be fun. Also, to the keen-eyed observer, you'll see that the day count, 14, is actually higher than when we last played. I played one in-game day off stream to grind up some bitter sprays. So I now have five extra bitter sprays and I also built up my yellow and Pikmin army and a few extra blue Pikmin. So before we start, we're actually going to make sure that we copy our data at the beginning. So that way if anything goes wrong, we don't have to reset a whole bunch of stuff. Copy this over. Hopefully this doesn't corrupt anything. <laughs> Beautiful. Alright. There we go. Oh yeah, there's going to be a lot of bomb rocks this video, so... I'm scared of the two caves, so we have a couple... Of, we have three above-ground treasures left in Perplexing Pool. Two above-ground treasures in the Valley of Repose, plus uh, two caves that we haven't done. And then everything in Wistful Wild. Now, Wistful Wild, we are not even going to set foot into until we have no other choice, because that ranks the difficulty of the game up from a 10 to a 25. I f I'm scared of the two caves we have left in the Valley of Repose. I think I'm going to start... I'm going to ease my way into this uh, video. We're going to Perplexing Pool. We're going to try to finish everything up here. Because I went to Perplexing Pool the last few de in-game days in a row, I think a lot of the enemies stood sh should still be dead, which means it'll be easier to traverse. So we're going to start with Perplexing Pool. I don't remember where all of the remaining treasures are, but I have a hunch we're going to need a lot of blue Pikmin, so... I'm going to take, like... 70 with me. Also, I'm only going to take Olimar with these Pikmin. I'll leave the, the president behind, so that way if I want to go back and multitask at all, I can. Now, are the Sheerwigs still dead? I sure hope so. Okay, good. Yes. See? this This is why. This is why I went back to Perplexing Pool, because the Sherwigs are dead, so we don't have to kill a bunch of enemies in preparation for anything. Alright, so I'm looking at things. So I think we got everything over by the shower room. I think we've gotten everything around here. We did the... the... the ragu lid over there. I think there's a treasure by the submerged castle. And there's a treasure over here. Okay. Smear him. Beautiful. I also believe there's a treasure over here. Actually, we, we might need yellow Pikmin for this. I can't quite remember. But there's definitely a treasure around here. Oh, yep, there's a lid up there. So we're going to need yellow Pikmin for that. Wonderful. Done. Alright. 
I can have the president take care of that while I explore more of the blue Pikmin. Where are the other two blue Pikmin? Okay. They're over here. They got thrown amuck by the swooping snitch bug. Alright, let's head over then towards the submerged castle. Because I know, I know for a fact there's an elevator puzzle over here. Welcome, Proxima! Nice to see ya! Welcome, welcome, welcome. Alright, no. No sprays, but that's okay. We at least have all flower pe- No! Get back, stupid switch snooch- Blech. Stupid Starno Sneech. Take that. Oh, it's my arch nemesis. It's a stupid frog. He re he respawned. I'm gonna ignore you for now. I hate that frog so much. Cool, cool. Let's get rid of the Hermit Cromads before they can do anything. I'm less scared of the Hermit Cromads than I am of the Water Dumples. Water Dumples are not fun to deal with. Yeah, sure enough. Alright, we'll just take out some of the enemies here. Let's see. Let's see, we got two water doubles. I can't... Will the best strategy be to just swarm them, or to toss... I'm gonna swarm them. No! Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Darn it, he ate them. It's too fat. Alright. That's fine. I'm fully expecting this. I don't remember how to get all the treasures here, so a lot of this is just exploration. But that's okay. I now know... Where, that there's that yellow Pikmin puzzle that we have to do as well. So we're going to need a small amount of yellow Pikmin. And then a bunch of blue Pikmin. That's fine. That's fine. I'm fully expecting a bunch of deaths and a bunch of resets. No need to get mad with uh, for a little reason. <laughs> also, one thing I might do is that if I make some progress and get a treasure, I might take a dip into a cave just to get a checkpoint in the middle of the day. Alright. We'll leave the president. I'm again going to take those 70 blue Pikmin. Alright, so there are three treasures left. I know where two of them are. The last one is still a bit of a secret. I should have left that last one in the onion, because the one... We oh, wait, no, the wait a second. There we go. I can pick up the one leaf Pikmin that we have and carry him, <laughs> so he won't slow us down. Let's see if we've got a spray here now. Nope. Oh, well, Mr. Leaf can drink that up. All right. We should probably kill the frog earlier rather than later. Really? Because the frog is pretty glitchy, and it'll be better to deal with him sooner rather than later. Nemesis frog will die. There we go. Get Nemesis Frog out of here. I don't want to deal with him. <laughs> I 
The tree branches that are partially in the water do make it annoying to deal with the rough terrain. You can mess up your battle prowess. I wish the blue Pikmin were a little bit more powerful. Okay. We're gonna lure this water dumple away from the other water dumple? Because if I have to deal with both of them at the same time, then that might be where we end up losing some Pikmin. Cool, cool, cool. You're doing great, men. Now let's take out the puff the withering bull hog. Nice job. So this is the elevator puzzle. Oh shoot, I might actually need the the president over here. I Why can't Omar walk up here? Darn it, okay. I think for the elevator puzzle we actually do need both captains over here, so... That's fine. All of the... well... I think all of the dangerous enemies have been cleared out along the way. Like, there's the fiery bull hog here, and I guess a swooping snitch bug, but the swooping snitch bug can't actually kill your Pikmin. And the puffy bull... or the fiery bull hog is pretty far out of the way, so I'm not too worried about that. Also, we can't even carry the treasure past that area anyways. We're going to take the long way around. Alright. My, on my only priority, really, is to get that... the giant thumb screw treasure. Alright. So how am I going to do this? Uh. Oh, that's more than 46. Okay. Yeah, this is a weird puzzle. Um... Yeah. <clears throat> Kinda need you guys to fly up on top of this elevator platform right here. Alright, one more. Okay. I am... Mm, those stupid Pikmin on the bottom are not moving. <sighs> yeah, this is a really obnoxious puzzle. No, no, no! No! Omar, you freaking no! J jerk -a. I did not whistle for you! Alright, this is. Yeah, this, this puzzle sucks. Okay.
This is dumb that, like, you can't walk up, half, like, a quarter of an inch. You have to do this stupid puzzle. Hi, Mobius. Welcome, welcome. Maybe I'm doing this wrong. Yeah, this seems like it's a better plan. I'll make sure there are 25 Pikmin up there. There we go. Well, that, was, that was an annoying puzzle, but there we go. <laughs> yeah, I, I like streaming on Saturdays, but sometimes Saturdays don't work out. Like this last weekend, it did not work out, so. Alright, now making sure we're not leaving any Pikmin behind. Good, good, alright. So now they're going to carry this back. I need to make sure that if they carry this back, they're not going to run into any kind of untoward trouble. Oh, they actually... Oh, I see. Shortcut. Alright, there should... I believe there's still a... Sw yeah, here's the swooping snitch bug. I'll take him out. Really? I got bad aim, apparently. And I guess we'll kill the fiery blowhog as well. Oh man, the bitter berries already got covered in cobwebs. go. And here comes the nut. Yeah, sure. Bring the spoils back. Why not? <laughs> I don't know why you're going out of your way to walk around that, but alright. Sure. <laughs> okay, we're just collecting this treasure today. I mean, I'll see what I can do with the yellow Pikmin at that one part, but it took most of the day to grab this, so I'm not expecting anything else. Do 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 do. Olmar can climb up rocks. The problem is, apparently, that was like just a few pixels too high for him to walk up, which is weird. Alright, Massive Nut goes back to the ship. One hundred Pocos, nice. The mass the massage girdle. That's a weird name. I love being able to pluck Pikmin just with the megaphone. Alright, we have 104 blue Pikmin. We don't need any more. For this next treasure, I'm just gonna bring, I think, yellows. You don't want a whole lot of yellows for this puzzle, because one wrong step and they can fall in the water. Gonna 
toss them up there so we don't have to navigate them up the, all these crazy slopes with the water nearby. All right. We won't be able to get the treasure back, but we might be able to at least get it down to make it easier to grab the next day. Alright, no, 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 don't, don't fall off. Let's just see how far they can take this. Yeah, it would be not fun if we had the pigment die. Okay, we can at least take it to the bridge. There we go. So now, oh, it's oh, it's the Vlasic pickle lid. Nice. Yeah, that'll be really easy to grab on the next day. And then we have the whole rest of the day to figure out where the remaining treasure is. All right, nice job. We only had to reset once. But honestly, I have no idea where that last remaining above-ground treasure is, even though I've played this game a couple times. <laughs> Don't remember where all the overworld treasures are. Frogs, dwarf bull bears, and the fiery bull hog. That is a lot of wallywogs. <laughs> yep, so far so good. It is today's report. This is the easy part of the stream, for sure. The hard part's going to be when we go to Valley of Repose and go to the caves. I'm quite scared for that. Mail. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, my allowance doubled, and it's all thanks to my papa. After all, he's a great captain, but when in the world will we be able to come home, huh? Oh, also, the, the mail that uh, you guys missed that I got for the off-day stream is Olmar's wife. Olmar, you've worked so hard, your special bonus arrived today. This is the f this is the first, right? I bought the kids a few things they've been wanting. They were so happy, and so was I. Aww. Oh, um, we're gonna have to reset like 15 to 20 times in the caves per sub-level. <laughs> I- you have no idea what's in store for us. And I probably have forgotten a lot of what's in store for us. I just want to finish up Perplexing Pool, get out of the way, and then it'll be good. <laughs> and then we'll be good. Then we only have to come back if we want to get Bitter Sprays. And even then, there's a better way to grind up Bitter Sprays coming up. Okay, we're gonna need to make some of these guys flower pigmen as well. Because we got a lot of leaf pigmen right now. Have the sheer wigs respawned? Yes, they have. Yeah. I don't think it's worth it. Uh, trying to toss them right on the backs to just smear them. Alright, bring the Vlasic lid back. You've never seen play Pikmin, and you've seen very few... Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> Trust me, the sub-levels of the upcoming... All five... We have five caves left in the game. They're all really nasty. The next two that we do are going to be really, really tough. Along the same length of a submerged castle, maybe a little tougher. And then all of the ones in Wistful Wild, like, just kill yourself now. <laughs> like, I'm the ones in Wistful Wild, I'm truly not sure if I'll actually be able to do no deaths or not. <laughs> hey, Nintendo Addict, welcome! Happy Sunday. <laughs> it's the perfect, perfect game to play on Sunday. <laughs> Vlasic, big taste, big crunch. The Gherkin Gate. Oh wow, they actually use the word Gherkin. I did not realize that Gherkins were tiny pickles for a very, very, very long time. Like, up until a few months ago. <laughs> Alright, we have one treasure left. Don't know where it is. 
Ah, no! Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him! That was way too close. Stupid shearwigs. Alright. Alright, everybody become a flower, Pikmin. Cool. Gonna make a bold... We're gonna, we're gonna go off to... Citadel Spires to get a checkpoint now because I've killed all these Shearwigs and I really, really don't want to. <laughs> and then, there we go. We create a checkpoint. Boom. Because I don't want to have to kill those Shearwigs again every single time. Game has been saved. All right. <laughs> Perplexy Pool's a big stage, so I don't know where to go, but I'm just gonna... Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Gonna leave all the Pikmin behind of the Ever Captain. As Olmar, I'm just gonna kind of walk around until I see where the treasure detector is detecting things. Not much point in bringing my Pikmin along and risking death if I don't even know where I'm supposed to be going. I wonder if there's something back where the yellow Pikmin were. That's a possibility. Hmm. The rules for Discord in general, or the rules for my Discord? Because my Discord has pretty lax rules. It's more just like... Don't spam, don't swear. <laughs> I mean, again, absolutely no pressure to join Discord at all. There are those little buggers. See, I don't know what you mean by questions, because is it like questions you have to answer in order to join Discord in general? Because I don't remember asking any questions for... My server. For my server, there are, like, the rules you have to, like, say, yeah, I agree to these, but... Alright, where where the heck are we going? Maybe there's something over by the shower room that I actually didn't grab. <laughs> I thought today it would just be a good day for Olmar to take a walk. Because we got the fishing bobber from Toady Boyster. We got the onion that was buried underground. Let's see... I don't think there are any treasures around here. I'll wait. There it, there was something. Interesting. Maybe it's something buried underground? All right. Apparently, Shower Room does have something for us, after all. Wait, that... hmm. Maybe I should have brought yellow Pikmin along instead. Hmm. 
Yeah, because I don't want them getting electrocuted. Because even though we've turned off the ele even though we've destroyed the electric fence, there's still an electric current going through it. I did not push the A button there. Okay, apparently that doesn't work. This is weird. <laughs> like, I've, again, I've played the game before. I don't even know where I'm supposed to be going. Maybe it's something that's near the shower room, but not actually the shower room. Like, maybe it's something buried on this side of the wall. There, yep, there it is. And actually, white Pikmin are so fast they might be able to even avoid the frog just by carrying it. Yeah, look at him go! Frogs are too slow to do anything about that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. Yes, there's the last treasure. Oh man, that was even in an easy spot. <laughs> Give me the power. Some kind of shell. The fortified delicacy. I think that's a mollusk shell, I want to say. Alright. Which means we can end the day early and get out of this dump. And by get out of this stuff, I mean go to the, a much more difficult world. Well done, White Pikmin. You make me proud. <laughs> Alright, see ya, Wally Wog. <laughs> Trying to sit on each other. We may never come back to this world. And that's okay. Today, we got the Vlasic Lid and the Fork Divide Delicacy. <laughs> Mollusks and Gherkins. It's mail from somebody. Spam. I am so lonely. I want a friend that'll listen to my troubles. I want to meet someone like you. Contact me at http colon slash slash www.pikmin.com. <laughs> no. Man, gotta turn up the spam filter now. <laughs>